Hey guys, it's Shibo2311, and welcome back to some more Pokemon Fire Red. And I'm only now realizing, I have actually played this game before. I haven't played Fire Red, but remember the after game to Soul Silver? Well, that was basically Fire Red slash Leaf Green. So yeah, where we are now is Pewter City. We're gonna be exploring the city, so let's start off by talking to this guy here. There are many serious Pokemon trainers here. They're all like bug catchers, you know? You know, just hobby hobbyists. But Pure Jib Brock isn't like that, not one bit. Hmm, I wonder if he is a bug type trainer, gym leader, whatever. I'll put him under appear in battle, however briefly earn experience boys. Yeah, um, until you got the experience share. I'm sorry I'm spoiling everything, it's not like you know about it already, you know? You don't know about the experience share. You've never played Pokemon your entire life! <laughs> Pokemon learn new techniques as they grow, but some moves must be taught to them by people. Huh. My Pokemon becomes easier to catch if it has a status problem. All of those craps. Of course, you gotta use better stuff than the poke balls. They get great balls. Shaved balls, all of those balls. Man, the balls. All of them. They're just so amazing. The ultra ones, the master ones. I'm sorry I'm putting it like that to you guys. I just am. There's some people in here. What do you have to say? Do you know what I'm doing? Yes. That's right. It's hard work. You don't have to whisper that to me. But there seems like there should be a hidden item here. A stone gray city. Yeah, it is kind of boring, isn't it? Well, I can't really say much about it because I haven't really seen much of it. I've just seen a little bit of it. Let's head up this way and see what the people gotta say. I don't want to really head off to the sides yet because that ain't what this episode is about. Today, we just exploring the city, talking to people, being all social. Did you check out the museum? Nope, I did not. Really? You absolutely have to go. Why you have to carry me? You told me I have to go. You... What are you carrying me for? I I can walk. This is it. The museum. You have to pay to get in, but it's worth it. See you around. <laughs> Do I actually have enough money to get in? <laughs> I'm wondering if I have enough money because I spend it all out on Pokeballs. Now see, that's why I don't usually catch all the Pokemon. He... He just had to show me where the museum was. I'm not realizing. He just sh showed me and was like, Okay, I'm gone now. Yeah, that's why I don't usually catch Pokemon. It's, sometimes you may use the money for other stuff. Sometimes you want to save it. Well, I'll do it this way for this Let's Play. Why not? Clefairy came from the moon. That's what the rumor is. They appeared after Moonstones fell on Mount Moon. And I'm guessing we're going to Mount Moon sometime soon. Can we go into this? Yeah, we can use this ship. Okay, that's a rock type gym. I'm not gonna really reveal too much about it, but water is actually effective on rock if you didn't know your Pokemon statistics. All oh, these places look like they have so much hidden items potential. I don't even know if I can, I can get hidden items at this point in the game. I'm just pressing around, you know, looking for hidden items and luck. So yeah, there's a museum on that side of town. There's a few stuff up here. Let's go up here and check out the stuff they have to offer. Of course I can't check it out. I can't cut down the tree. Huh. Actually, I think after I conquer that gym, I can um, cut down that tree. So um, maybe we might be able to take on a gym this episode. Why not? Let's look at these guys. Nidoran, sit! Bow bow! A Pokemon's an outsider, so it's finicky and hard to handle. An outsider is a Pokemon that you get in a trade. It goes fast, but it may ignore an unskilled trainer in battle. Yada yada yada. All, all this is stuff that I already know, or stuff that I don't want to know, or stuff like he's not gonna let us go. You're a trainer, right? Brock's looking for new challenges. Follow me. What is it with people in this town and following them? Why do we have to be so orderly? And he's leading me right back to where I was. Like. Really? Why? What? Uh, okay? Okay then. See you later. 
Okay, so I guess we will take on Brock today. Am I full up on um health? Yeah, I have I have five Pokemon. No, no, I, I need to go to the Poke Center. And screw that! I don't go to Poke Center. Oh, back here in the gym. Um, hi, do you want a dream bag? Do you dare to dream of becoming the Pokemon champ? I'm no trainer, but I can advise you on how to win. Let me take you to the top. Yeah. All right, let's get it happening. The first Pokemon out in the match is the Oh God, please stop talking to me. Yeah. Um. There's one trainer. Hi. I don't remember it being this easy. You're 10,000 light years from facing Brock. Well, if that's what 10,000 light years is, then I guess I have nothing in life to worry about. Huh, let's fight Camper Liam, who has a Geodude. You got him, my champ. Don't try to woo me with- I won't trade my Pikachu. Yeah, from- I, I don't remember their name. <laughs> I, I really don't remember their, um, their, I know they did parodies, obviously. He's about to turn out to Sand True. Oh, would I ever change after gaining a level and not losing any health? Oh no, why would I do that? Um, I think I'm gonna have serious problems facing Brock. 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 <laughs> Brock. Light years isn't time and measure distance. Okay. So, um, Brocky Brock, I think I'm gonna have such a hard time facing you. I can't, I can't do it. I can't do it. Of course, if you knew what sarcasm was, then you would know I was using it there. So you're here. I'm Brock, the computer's gym leader. My rock hard willpower is evident, even in my Pokemon. My Pokemon are all rock hard and have true grit determination. That's right, my Pokemon are all rock type. Voila! You're going to challenge me knowing what you'll lose? That's a trainer's honor that compels you to challenge me. Fine then, show me your best. Okay, it's time to face Brock. The gym leader of the first gym who has the same lot of Pokemon as his trainer who was trying to block me from him. He starts off with the same Pokemon two levels higher. I'm still three levels higher than it. Am I gonna knock it out in one hit? Who knows? Maybe this is me finally getting somewhere after losing twice to my rival um i'm gonna evolve after this battle aren't i i'm growing levels like like nobody's business he has an onyx i have fond memories of geodude and onyx because my first game was um diamond yeah i i actually did not get into gaming until i was like eight around that time I don't even know what it, okay I think it was bind or something Wow Brock I'm sorry but I I put some water on your rock hard whale power and I think I softened it up so um if you're having that problem with constipation just um drink some of Squirtle's water I took you for granted and so I lost as proof of your victory, I confer you this official Pokemon League Boulder Badge. Wait, Boulder Badge? That means... That means I can go to the other guy who was saying you don't have the Boulder Badge. Yeah. Flash. I, I love Flash so much. I teach it to all my Pokemon. I told you it was gonna happen. Your garden hose involved into a war turtle. Wait, take this with you. This is TM39. What TM is it? What TM is it? Rock Tomb, okay. Well, if I get a rock type or something that can learn it, I'm gonna probably teach it to it. Oh, also, if you're from the new generation, back in these days at Pokemon, you could only use TMs once, you can use them multiple times like you can now in black and stuff. 
And he actually said that, I just didn't bother to read it out because I don't like reading text. We're done with that episode now. But, um, next time we'll check out the museum? I wonder how big this museum is gonna be. Anyway, I'll finish off the episode right here. I think it's a good place to end. We took out a gym leader, all of that. In, with no trouble at all, actually. So, yeah, I'm gonna end it off here. And next time we'll check out this museum.